Hey folks, hope you do good today. Thanks for tuning in for another Monday Grind. Today we've got a sick one lined up. Just five bands this week, uh, but five totally different bands. Every single one has just got a, their own sound going on. It's going to be a nice one. Uh, the first band we've got to look at, they've got an animated video for us as well, which we love from the Grind guys. This is Basimba Dara with Euphoria Derita. Here we go. Amazing. Love the video. One of the better ones we've had as well from the animated guys. Absolutely dope. And a sick track, man. Heavy and thick guitars in there. Having that uh, ride rattling away in your right ear sounded amazing as well. Yeah, that's how you kick off a Monday grind. Now we've got these guys again, the Mormon Mincers, and they've got a suicide pack this week. Here we go. I blame not heaven, but rather a society that tells its youth that the answers can be found in the MTV video games. Crazy sound, dope sound. Absolutely loved it, man. We haven't seen these guys for a while and they're on a launch air youth, which is super dope. This is Thin with a track called Th Foliage, if I can get my words out. Oh, I love seeing bands on Launch Air Youth. We've been following for a while, but haven't actually seen play live because you get to see them play live, but also an amazing recording as well. Now, the only thing that's weird about Launch Air Youth is they do only ever upload one track of like this performance. Now, I'm not sure what the situation is with Launch Air Youth, whether you go to their studio or what, um, but you just play one track and that's it. You're out of there. You've got to set up all your gear, play one track and you're out uh, because they never seem to upload more than one track from the band. So there you go. That's it. I don't know if there's kind of a, a Patreon or something where you have to subscribe to see the full gig or anything like that, but uh, there you go. <laughs> We're going to have a good time as well with the Good Time Aussie Bogglers. This is a funny video as well called F That Coke Head. Here we go. <laughs> it's 
it? No one does rednecks quite like the Australians. Maybe uh, New Zealanders are kind of a bit more down that hole if you kind of get them in the outback. Uh, but yeah, the Australian bogglers, man. They're funny guys. We're going to finish off with a totally different sound again. And every band has been dope with their own sound today. But this guy's got his own sound. I'm pretty sure it's a one-man band. Ozzy Giri with some grind dome, uh, breakbeat, grindcore, kind of cyber grind stuff. We're going to finish off with this. Here we go. Great job. Loads of great sounds to listen to in there. The only gonna thing I'm going to say about this kind of style of music, this guy has really nailed it. And for a one-man band, I am hope I'm not speaking out of tune there with saying he's a one-man band, but I'm pretty sure it is a one-man band. But anyway, however many people are in this band, they're doing a really great job of this break course style. They got all the right sounds. It's all balanced nicely. I like the vocal effect and how that's sitting over the top and bringing that kind of extra level into it. But if you've heard this kind of music before, you'll have heard basically this kind of track before as well, because what's going on with these breakcore guys, and they've been doing it for like 25 odd years now, is they, they go out of their way to just mash it up as much as they can, use as many different effects and weird kind of VSTs and ways to create the sounds and things like that so that they're just mashing all these crazy sounds together and they've really taken that to the extreme as well um, like with all the kind of cuts and spl splicing it and panning it across your ears so your brain just starts to melt throughout your ears you know because there's so much stuff going on and some of it is a bit too much in that direction and I do like it where there's a bit more of a groove like in this one so you can actually catch your breath for a second between all the glitching out and going mad but the only thing I was say about it is I don't know how you're going to think outside the box with this kind of music now because guys have purposely thought outside the box or tried to at least and then created their own box outside the normal box um, because they've just tried to take this mashup to the extreme in every direction so I don't know 
how you're going to out extreme those guys is basically the point I'm getting at. Um, because if you've listened to this music, there's some really mad stuff of this out there. Um, and you just think, man, where can they go from here? You know, how can you make it any more glitched out or extreme and loud and just in your face music? So there you go. That's the only thing I would say about guys getting into this scene is you might find that you know, you, you start sounding like other guys, even when you're really trying hard to think outside the box and do all different stuff. And there's so much effort that goes into this kind of music as well, because every sound needs some, its own VST or instrument and things like that. And you have to do all the effects on that, mashing it all up, cutting it all up, splicing it all together and all the stuff like that. It really takes a lot of time in the mix and in the DAW. Uh, and those guys have just really, really gone at that stuff for a long time now. Uh, so if you're getting into this scene, you're going to maybe struggle to carve out your own sound and your own path um, unless you really think outside the box. If that's the case, I want to hear it as well uh, because, yeah, there's so much going on in this music. There's a lot to listen to. There you go. Five bands to kick off your week with. Five totally different bands with different sounds, different vibes, different edges, different guitar tones, and all the rest of it going on. Really cool videos as well. Animated videos, bogglers, and God knows what else as well. I'd love to see it. Uh, so there you go. That's how we've kicked off the week. I hope you had a good one. We've got nothing else lined up, although we did want to have one come through last week. If you missed that, some kind of pop punk stuff. Uh, but anyway, if we've got another band come through, you'll see me again this week. Otherwise, we'll see you next week make sure if you've got any grind though send it over as quick as you can uh because we are burning through the queue that's it from me we'll see you around guys hope you have a good one cheers bye